everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm coming at you with some more tips on how to look taller and I find that a lot of these suggestions and examples will also really help to streamline your silhouette and make you appear slimmer as well. For me, I use these tips a lot to balance out my proportions because while I am tall, I'm 172 centimeters, so that's just a bit above average. I do have a longer torso in proportion to my legs, so these tricks work a treat for me. So if you've got a similar body shape as well, that might work, but I think these are gonna be really great, especially if you're on the petite end of the spectrum. I am gonna be running some examples as well, like I did in the last video, which if you haven't watched, I'm gonna pop it up here so you can go check it out, just so that you can see the difference between how you can incorporate these little tricks and how they actually really do visually enhance how tall you appear. A little bit different to last time, a lot of these tips are really focused around the different styling pieces that you can use to your disposal to make you look taller. The first one being cropped tops. Now I find that having a top that is slightly more cropped, it makes your torso look a little bit shorter, but it also makes your legs look much longer, especially if you combine them with high-waisted pair of trousers. Now if you really want to kind of, uh, I guess, visually enhance how tall you look again, show a little sliver of skin in between the two. My next tip is to avoid wearing wide belts. You guys know that I love wearing belts and I really think that it can create a distinction between your upper and lower half and it can really help to define your waist. However, a wide belt, because it is so thick, it creates a really large horizontal line across the center of your torso and it can make your pair wider and actually shorten the way that your body pairs visually. I'm definitely a neutrals girl through and through, but sometimes you want to add a little bit of print into your wardrobe. And this is actually a very similar tip to what I shared in my how to look expensive video, but it is to keep your prints in proportion to your frame. So if you are on the petite side, you really want to wear prints that are a lot more micro. So if you love wearing florals, instead of wearing a really oversized floral print, something that is really bold as well, and that maybe you're not going to get so much mileage out of because it's going to be quite bold, opt for a Liberty print floral. This is a much more delicate print and I find that it really creates balance that you wouldn't get from wearing a large print. When it comes to coats, avoid anything that is too oversized and that will really swamp your frame. I've got this beautiful Stella McCartney coat, which is really oversized. And I can say for a fact, I do not think that coat makes me look any taller than I am. I feel great in it and it's a styling piece that I really love but it definitely doesn't add inches to my height. If you want to appear visually taller when you're wearing outerwear, opt for something that is cropped or if you really love that sort of longer style, go for maybe a duster trench, one that creates a visual column and something that is much more lightweight in fabric that has a lot of drape to it because what it will do is it'll be a lot more kind of cut close to your body. It won't create any bulk and it will make you look like you are longer and leaner than you are. My next tip is definitely not appropriate for the office. It's more something for when you are wearing a casual outfit, but it is to wear skirts that are about four to five inches above your knee. This actually makes your legs look so much longer than they are. I have to say, whenever I wear a mini skirt, and I've got this one from Wrangler, which I'm gonna show you guys in the cutaways, whenever I wear that skirt, my legs look like they are miles long, even if I'm wearing flats, and flats that aren't necessarily what I would call flattering. So yeah, I find that it just creates that visual illusion because you've got more leg on display, uh, and it just really, really does have the effect of making you look taller. My next two points are a little bit similar, but the first one is to match the color of your shoes to your trousers. So if you're wearing a black pair of trousers, then match it with black shoes, preferably pointed toe ones because they just really elongate the uh, leg because they draw your eye down further. So it creates that kind of visual illusion. I find that it really just creates a visual line and again, makes your pair taller. The next tip is to wear nude shoes, and I find that these are an instant leg lengthening trick. And unfortunately, I don't actually have a pair in my wardrobe, so I'm gonna show you guys in the cutaways with a pair of camel pumps, which I hope will kind of give you a bit of an indication of the effect that it does have. But these just instantly will make your legs look longer because the point where your foot ends and the shoe begins are sort of melded together. So again, 
draws the eye down further, makes your legs look longer, again, makes you look taller by proxy, but I find that uh, a pointed toe shoe is definitely the best way to go, again, because it's just drawing the eye down a lot further and creating that really long visual line. Now you guys know how much I love wearing denim, it's something that I've really embraced in the past probably 12 to 18 months. And something that I really focus on, because I do have that longer torso, but this is definitely a petite trick too, is to wear mid or high rise. If you're wearing a low rise jean, what it does is it makes your torso look a lot longer, makes your legs look shorter, so it can end up looking very unflattering and make you look shorter than you are. So if you're wearing a mid to high rise, what it does is it again, it makes your legs look longer because the eye is drawn up higher. Where your trousers or your pants begin is higher up, so it has that illusion of making your pair taller. If you combine this with the tip that I mentioned earlier about wearing crop tops, it's going to again add a few more inches to your frame. Something that I have really embraced with my body type is wearing high-waisted. And again, this is just such a great petite girl trick. If you're wearing something that is high-waisted, it makes it look like your legs start higher up than they are. I think especially if you're wearing something that has a longer length, this is a really good trick because it just makes it look like your legs go on for days. Now, I love this next trick, and it's something I talk about so much whenever it comes to workwear in particular, but I like to crop all of my trousers. The reason being is that if you have them slightly cropped above the ankle, what it does is it highlights the narrowest part of your leg for a start, but secondly, it looks like you are slightly too tall for your trousers, and it just adds inches to your height. You haven't really done or changed anything, but it just makes you look so much taller. So that is definitely a trick that I incorporate a lot into my outfit, something that you are not going to see going away anytime soon. And actually, it kind of goes on to my next point, which is tailoring. Now, I really think that it is so important to get clothing tailored to your body. When you purchase something from stores, it is not cut to fit your specific body shape, it's cut to fit a fit model. So it means that when you take it home, if you want it to be perfect for you and to really scream like it was made for you, you need to find a good tailor and then they can kind of alter certain elements of it so that it fits you perfectly. Uh, I would say the best way to find a good tailor is to look for reviews online and also word of mouth is probably the best way. So if you've got any friends who you know get items tailored regularly, ask them where they go because that is really the best recommendation that you can get. Uh, but yeah, if you have something that looks like it is made for you, if it fits you in all the right places, I think that that's going to really only elevate your look and I think it can help you to look taller as well, especially if you're combining that tailoring with a lot of the other elements that I've mentioned in this video. So those are 11 more tips on how to look taller and appear slightly slimmer as well, if that's your aim. I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. If you've got any more petite girl tricks, knowing that I'm actually a tall girl. <laughs> Please drop them in the comment section below because I know it will help out all of the other girls out there who are looking for some visual tricks to be able to make them appear taller. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. I hope that you enjoyed it and if you did, I would love if you could hit the thumbs up button. If you'd like to see more videos like this from me, then please subscribe and I will see you guys next time with a new video. See you soon. Bye.